Well, today I have sort of a fun drill. Uh, I have to make a movie prop uh, using my old equipment. Doesn't happen every day uh, that you're paid uh, to do something useful with your old equipment. Uh, but here the drill is for a movie that happened in the 60s. Um, and it's about the Kennedys. Uh, and uh, there's one uh, Part of the plot, or the important part of the plot, is when uh, Ted Kennedy runs into an accident, and this is the famous the car accident, and the famous Chakwapedic incident. Uh, because there was, uh, you know, he killed one of his aides, and uh, there were some you know, subsequent trial of cover up or whatever, uh, so it got all very dirty and political. But I don't have to worry about that. What I have to do is to replicate a driver's license uh, from the Massachusetts about that era. And uh, they sent me little actually. They sent me a copy of this uh, driver's license, which is actually Jackie's Ken Jackie Kennedy's, and an application. And as you can tell, it was made on a punch card. So I need a punch card equipment to make that and that's why they contacted me because they saw that I had one. And I have to first print it at the right size. Well, I can see how involved it gets, right? Because everything is a different font, a different size and the stamps are different. And once I have that I can measure it all and find the right fonts and then uh, I do it on the computer an illustrator version and then uh, after much annoyance I managed to have them print on my printer uh, on the right paper format and the cats do wag their tails so it uh, should be good Let's see what comes out all right no, it's pretty good. If that can refocus on it, there we go. And I had to do the same thing for a second form, which is the uh, uh, application. So time to do the typewriting, and I wanted it on uh, done on my typewriting machine because first I have one, and then it's going to make it more real. Uh, so here's a real electric uh, from the time where the original were done, and actually. Uh, I could find the original typefaces, um, they are different ones. This one was Prestige Elite 12 and the uh, application was uh, Gothic 12 but used at the 10 character spacing. It turns out I have a dual character spacing machine so I get to use all the functions of my old stuff. Uh, by pure chance I could reproduce it exactly. I doubt that they actually care at all. But since I could, I did. So uh, here we go, exact replica from 1968. And that's the money one. Bing! Right in the middle. Yay! There we go. So now it's time to punch things on my O29 punch. Um, and uh, for that I had to reverse engineer what were the punching on the cards. But it's actually fairly simple. It's the a license number followed by the name then there is a certain number of blanks and there is a code uh, which I'm not sure what it represents so we're going to redo the same on the punch as it was originally done
26, 07, 2, 5, 7, And the first one is already punched. And the process. There we go. There we go. All right. Now I can put it back. But do nothing. production of licenses all right so they are all done uh, all cut up and uh, they, they told me to make quite a bunch apparently they mess up often and do a lot of takes but here we go I can uh, drive in Massachusetts in 1968 or uh, apply for a driving license so now I'm just have to wait uh, after I send that for the movie to appear and see uh, if I get my two seconds of fame. <laughs>